Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be setting up this Mac. Now, we're going to be setting it up without any personal information. That means without an Apple ID, nothing. So usually you want to do this if you're selling your Mac. However, some people just don't want to import anything, which is completely fine. And I also want to highlight that it doesn't matter which Mac you have, from MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, it's going to be the exact same instructions. So let's get started with the basics. You're going to have to turn it on. So you're going to see this power button. Just hold on to it. For some of you, your Mac will turn on as soon as you open the lid anyways. Then you're going to see an Apple logo loading bar. You're going to see this screen. Let me just reposition this. And here we go. So once again, just choose your region. It does not matter which one it is. You can scroll down to see more of them. Or up here, it's just going to tell you which one you're most likely in. Press and continue. That's down here below. You're going to be pressing with your trackpad down here below. So this is your trackpad. You just press on it. And you're going to see that you're clicking. I also want to highlight that I do have my Mac charging up right now. However, if you have enough battery, you don't have to at this point. We're going to go on and choose not now. now. I'm doing it this far away right now just to show you that you do use your trackpad in order to choose things. You click on things for now in order to select them. Later on, you can set this up so you can just tap. Put in the password for your Wi-Fi. Going to next down here below on the bottom right hand corner. And you're just continuously going to do that actually. It's always going to be on the bottom right hand corner. If for any reason you can't hook up your Wi-Fi, you're having issues, you could use an Ethernet cable and that way just hook up your computer directly to your router using that Ethernet cable. We're going to go into next. At this point, like I mentioned before, we're not going to move anything. So we're not going to import any information. So on the left hand side, you're going to see this it says not now. Just press on not now. And then from here, it's going to ask your Apple ID. So this is the point where I'm going to tell you, don't write down anything, just set up later. So also on the bottom left hand side, you're going to see set up later and we're going to skip. And then we're just going to agree to these conditions. I agree again, put in the name. So we're just going to put in MacBook Air account name. I'm just going to leave it as MacBook Air. All right, password. This is something I wish we could just skip over. However, we do have to set up a password. Again, if you're just selling this or that's why you're watching this, you should do an easy password such as one, two, three, four, for example, we're going to do that again. One, two, three, four. And then on hint, you should write down something like password is one, two, three, four in numbers. And there you go. Just click on continue that way again. So you don't forget, obviously, if you do want to set up a password, set up a good one, don't even set up a hint. If you don't want to, then you're going to see this again, you do not have to enable location, but I would suggest doing so even if you're selling it. So we're going to go into that check mark, continue on. We're going to share everything with Mac. You don't have to, you can remove the check marks, then going to continue. Uh, screen time. This is something that's really for kids. If you're handing this off to your kids, so if you really want to see how much time you spend on your Mac, go ahead. But for most of you just set up later, bottom left hand side and Siri enable Siri. I would just leave it enable a uh, set of voice. You have five voices to choose from. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me Hi, I'm Siri. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice. If you don't want to choose a Siri voice, you can put choose for me. I would choose number four. Just, that's the classic one. We're going to go into continue and set up Hey Siri. So again, this is something that's personal and we're skipping all the personal stuff here. So we're going to set up later. On the bottom left hand side set up later uh we're gonna share or not now so you can share your recordings or put in not now i would do not now at, at this point you can always change any of these settings by the way later on now this is your touch id again you don't want to put any personal information such as your touch id because this right up here is touch id for your fingerprint we're going to set that up later as well which means we're not setting it up we're going to continue on and right here you can set up light mode dark mode Dark mode is what I personally like. However, for this video, so you guys can see better, I'm going to leave it as light mode. And there we go. You're all done. That's all you guys have to do. There's no personal information here. So the next person, if, if you're selling this, can just take it, factory store it. Just make sure they know the password. So tell them that it's one, two, three, four. And that's it. They could test it on. They can factory store it afterwards. I would still recommend to factory store it so they can activate it with their own Apple ID. It just works better doing it that way instead of just going into settings and setting up from there. It's a lot better just to do that. But anyways, at this point in time, you're all done. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like.
Thank you.